hi guys welcome back to my channel so we're here again with another you know you already know foundation friday and today the lucky baby is gonna be the l'oreal paris infallible 24 hour well you know her sunscreen 25 spf so if you want to see how this foundation work you already know what to do keep on watching Okay, so we're back and today for my primer, I'm using the e.l.f. Paula's face primer. I was fling this over. Let's put this down and let's talk about, you know, Miss In. We're using the L'Oreal Infallible Foundation. Um, it does have an SPF, which is good, you know, especially if it's you wear in the daytime. So I'm gonna... For some reason, I couldn't find it on the side, so I'm using the other side. Um, they have 40 shades, which is amazing. And if you can take a look, they do have like, like really dark shades, you know, and then to go all the way to the really pale shade. So that's I feel like that's really good. That's a really good shade range, and it's $15.99. Alter has a deal right now. Buy one, get one 50% off. Like me, I had to get two shades to kind of match me. So. So let me give you a little, you know, 411 on the foundation. So it's L'Oreal Infallible Fresh Wear 24 Hour Foundation is the most lightweight, breathable long wear foundation. Defies transfer hour after hour. Oh, it defies transfer hour after hour. I was like, huh? Benefits up to 24 hour natural finish with buildable coverage, resists transfer sweat and remains breathable all day. Again, I don't know who were in the foundation for 24 hours and the color stayed true all day. So I'm guessing no oxidation and features advanced formulas, three of oil absorbers, resist sweat, water and transfer infused with, with SPF 25, which is really good and non-comogenic and suitable for all skin types. So how to use, they give a little, you know, apply all over the face with your fingers or brush or use a beauty sponge. So again, I like applying my foundation with a brush. So that is what we're gonna do. And let me see, let me see which shade is like this brush is dirty. Oh, well, let me use this brush. This is a slick brush from Makeup by Orlando. And yeah, face feels good. I don't know, like so I have 510 and 505. I think 510 is a little bit dark. And I think 505 is a little bit light, like story of my life. So this is 505. See, I feel like this is too light. Is it though? Let's see. I don't like my foundation super light, so I mean, I just want it perfect, right? I mean, maybe 505 is my shade. Maybe. But I was curling my hair and I dropped my curling iron on my neck. And I know it looks like a hickey, but I promise you guys, it's not that. I am too grown for that. I don't know. So now I'm seeing... So this is the 510, which is the darker shade. Oh, I feel like 510 might be too dark. See, I, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. 510 is definitely too dark. So it looks like 505 is my shade. <laughs> but you know what? It's fine. We'll fix it. Yeah. 505 is my shade. See, this is 505 and this is 510. I think maybe I could get away with 510 and just like wear like a lighter concealer, but no, I think 505. That's where it's at. So it does have a smell or a scent, I should say. Nothing crazy. So this is how it looks when I add. I think 505 is my shade but it looks light see when I put it here see how light this looks 
I think. So what is in my forehead? Oh. Let's see when I blend it. Yeah. I mean, I don't want my face to be super pale. Already, I'm I'm going for the kind of golf look with my makeup. Okay, I'm gonna give you guys a close-up. Foundation looks nice. Um, I don't know what what is the finish. I didn't quite see what the finish is. Just a, but usually for me, if a foundation is has SPF in there, it's usually not matte. I mean, cause I'm using like a mattifying, I guess. So yeah, it's buildable coverage, I guess. I don't want to go too heavy with that, cause uh, ain't nobody at time for that. And I am having not the best skin day. Like I'm breaking out, I'm stressed out, I have a lot going on. Okay, so this is the final look, and this is how everything is laying on this foundation. This foundation looks looks really good, guys. I've only been wearing it for like maybe 30 minutes, so not a long time, but I will. Give you guys a check in maybe when i'll be waiting for like a couple hours and then i will well a follow-up slash check in and then i'll give you another check in maybe around later in the night when i'm eating and maybe drinking why not and yeah and at the end of the night i will give my final thoughts on this foundation and how it wear throughout the day i'll see you guys later Hi guys, so I'm here. I'm doing a check-in, you know. Look at this background though. So now I've been wearing this foundation for maybe about two hours, so it's still looking good. You know, about to go eat, so you know that lipstick will be gone in like you know a few seconds. So yeah, still going strong. So that's it for now. I'll give you guys one more check-in later and then I'll give you my final thoughts on the video on the video. I will see video on the foundation. Hi guys. Hi guys, so I'm doing another check-in. I know the lips are like totally gone. Um, I have a little separation here and just a little bit on the tip of my nose, but this is normal, you know, because still have the cold, I'm still washing, you know, kind of rubbing my nose, but apart from that, the foundation is lasting really, really good. So yeah, so this is my final check-in and I will let you guys know at the end of the night how the foundation works out. Um, I think I'll be waiting for maybe like five hours, five, six hours. So yeah, so that's it for me now. I will see you guys later. Hi guys, so I'm back and ready to give my final thoughts on this foundation. Okay, so let's take a mirror. I look hella shiny. Like right here, my forehead is kind of shiny. 
I have some separation here and I have a little bit of separation here but I still have the cold or sinus issues something's going on with it so I'm constantly like you know wiping my nose so it explains that part of it and then here I was eating so I think I wiped my mouth or wiped my lipstick up at some point so yeah so that's about that so this I can explain and I have lipstick all the way over here I can kind of explain that right here I have a little bit of separation like right here and yeah I have some separation right here too I kind of want to start on my mouth but that could also be because I was wiping my mouth but yeah final thoughts that foundation is a thumbs up you know if you're looking for kind of a long way of foundation because I think I'm wearing this foundation maybe for like five hours maybe, yeah because it's like 10 o'clock and I've been wearing it since around three so yeah I would say it's a pretty you know decent wear um it's also housing on 40 shades and there's some super super dark shades and it's only 50.99 and they say Ulta always have like 50 percent off on those so you could always get this for like you know 750 so that's it guys for this video don't forget to like subscribe join the family and you know what i'll see you on my next video bye guys to my body i should have known just because you spent the night doesn't mean you are me i should have known not to let my guard down so damn fast before even knowing where we're really at guess i never should have let you in so close to my body my body my body